Question 3. Express the number appearing in the following statement in standard form. Again, we have to do it in standard form. That is 1 micron is equal to 1 upon 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 6 zeros are the meter. Okay. So, how we will convert it? You know already how to convert into a standard form. That is by 1 by 10 raised to 6 will come. So, he, if we are bringing it up, that would be 1 multiplied by 10 raised to minus 6 meters. So, this will be our answer in a standard form. Here, 1 we have to multiply because we, as, uh, as per our rule, the number should be between 1 and 10. Question 2. Charge of an electron is point. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18. 18 zeros are there and 1, 1, 6, 16 is there. 16 coulomb. 1, 6, 6 coulombs. Now, let's do it in fraction form first. Just keeping 16 above and then 18 till 18 zeros we have counted. So, 19 and 20. So, 20 zeros will come. I am just expressing this in exponent form that is 10 raised to 20 you can write the zeros 20 zeros or else you can write 10 raised to 20 coulombs coulomb okay so now how we will uh, convert the, we have to convert this between the digit should be between 1 and 10 so 1.6 okay so we have to multiply with 10 divide by 10 raised to 20 which is equal to 1.6 multiply by 10 raised to 1 minus 20 exponents will be subtracted so that is equal to 1.6 multiplied by 10 raised to minus 19 we have to write the unit here that is coulomb so this is our answer in standard form next is size of a bacteria is 0 0.000005 meter so again first convert this into fraction form 5 divided by 1 2 3 4, 5, 6, 7. 7 zeros will come. I am directly putting right now in exponent form that is 10 raised to 7 meters. So, if it is already between 1 to uh, 10, so nothing to convert here. Directly bring the 10 raised to 7 in numerator. That is 5 multiplied by 10 raised to, if we are coming, it, uh, it is coming in numerator, then it will be minus 7 meters. So, size of a bacteria will be 5 multiplied by 10 raised to minus 7 meters in standard form. Now, size of a plant cell is 0.00001275 meters. So, again, this should be converted into fraction form 1275 divided by 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. 8 zeros are there. I am writing in exponent form 10 raised to 8 meters. Now, what we have to do? We have to bring this number between 1 and 10. So, 1, 2, 3, 3 point we will move. That is 1.275. Multiply by how many zeros will come here then? 3 zeros. By divide by 10 raised to 8 meters. Here, 1.275 multiply by 10 raised to 3 divide by 10 raised to 8. The expons exponents are we uh, in these are in division so we will subtract the exponents 10 raised to 3 minus 8 10 raised to 3 minus 8 that is equal to now 1.275 multiplied by 10 raised to minus 5 meter so this is our standard form now fifth is the thickness of a thick paper is 0 0.07 mm so, let's start with bringing this in a fraction form that is 7 divided by 100 mm and that is nothing but 7 by 10 square that is equal to 7 multiplied by 10 raised to minus 2. This digit is already between 1 and 10 so we will not move any point. So, this is our final answer in standard form 7 multiplied by 10 raised to minus 2 mm. Question 4. In a stack there are 5 books each of thickness 20 meter so five books are there and one book's thickness is 20 meter 20 mm so how many uh, what is the thickness of five books that you can do it that is 5 multiplied by 20 and five paper sheets each of thickness 0 0.016 mm so one 
thi uh, thickness of each sheet is given so how many paper sheets are there five so again here for uh, thickness of five paper sheets we have to multiply five multiplied by 0 0.016 mm okay now what is the total thickness of the stack that we have to add this is simple so let's start thickness of a book is what is thickness of each book of a book is 20 mm so thickness of five books will be 20 mm multiplied by 5 that is equal to <clears throat> 100 mm sorry uh, huh, yes 100 mm okay now thickness of a paper sheet what is the thickness of a paper sheet is each paper sheet is 0 0.016 mm and so the thickness of 5 paper sheet will be 0 0.016 multiplied by 5 that is equal to 0.08 mm okay so we got all the thicknesses now what we have to next step is total thickness of the stack so that for that we will add both the digits now therefore total thickness of a stack will be equal to thickness of a book thickness of books plus thickness of paper sheet what is the thickness of book that we have calculated is 100 100 plus and thickness of paper sheets is 0 0.08 mm both are in mm so we will write it as it is then 100 plus 0 0.08 will be nothing but 100.08 just the point because uh, before uh, before point that is from uh, left side there there is only zero so hundred plus zero will be hundred and then after point here nothing is there after point so it will be same as it is so this is our answer and we have to write in standard form so in standard form how this can be written how this can be written in standard form so let's start it. 100.08 mm we have to write in standard form so what is our rule it sh the number should be between 1 and 10 so two places we have to move this side so if you are uh, moving this side that is 0, 0, 0, 0008 multiply by 10 raised to 10 square okay so this will be our answer that is 1.0008 multiply by 10 square mm Got it? How we are doing it in standard form? Okay. 